Hi guys, good evening. Hello everybody. Guys, hello, good evening. Guys, are you there? Do you hear me? Yes, teacher. Hi, how are you? Mm, busy, teacher. Busy? Why? Are you working? Yes. Really? Why? Yes. It's late. It is late. Yes, but I want to leave the office in a few minutes. Okay, that's okay. No problem. Okay, just be careful. It is late already. It is eight. Eight or all. Okay, no problem. Yes, teacher. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, take your time. Let us know. Let us know when you're when you're available. Okay, people. Hello. Thank you for being here. Thank you very much. Thank you so much for taking the class into consideration. This is the second last class mm -hmm. we're gonna finish tomorrow. Okay. It's been a it's been a good run. You know, we we have had fun, so we're almost done. We're almost done. Okay, guys, thank you for being here. Thank you for being here. I'll be taking attendance soon. Susan, welcome, Gloria, Wilfredo, Adriana, Lourdes, Ophelia, uh, Flor, Luis, Gabriela, and Walter. Guys, thank you for being Hi. here, thank you for joining the class. It's a pleasure to have you guys here again. I'm gonna take attendance right now. Hold on, give me a second here. So there's something happening here. Today, today will be the last. Okay. All right, guys, let me take attendance real quick. Real quick, we got a few people already. Rosa, this is not happening today. No, 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 no. Impossible. It's the last day, teacher. No, no, it's not the, the last day. The last day. <laughs> today it will be the last day. It would be the last day if I hadn't if I hadn't skipped a day last week. Because remember, I was I was yes. in this today yes. will be the last day. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I'm here, teacher. Believe. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. Okay, Gloria and and and, and uh, hello. <laughs> Look at them; they are together. <laughs> okay, excellent. Thank you guys for being here. No me puedo conectar, por eso estoy intentando con el celular de de mi hermana. Okay. Yes, because you need you need to be you need to be here. I mean, separately. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, that, that's the room. That's the room. I'm sorry. Okay, guys, let me take attendance. Today we have a lot to do. There is a lot of reading to do today, which is good. You know, you're going to practice your reading skills. Uh, let me start Ada Patricia Linares Galdames. Present teacher. No. <laughs> you are Gloria. No, no, teacher, no me puedo conectar por eso. Ya, 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 ahorita. Sorry. Adriana Stephanie Martinez Flores. Okay. Present. Hi. Ana Selmi Chévez. She's not here yet. Um, Gabriela Alejandra González Flores. Present. Present, teacher. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Here. Excellent, excellent. Good people, good people. 
Okay, let's continue. Guadalupe and Carmen Lopez Flores. No. Jose Ernesto Osorio Morán. Julia Patricia Vázquez Santos. Okay, no. Carla Verónica Vázquez de Rivas. Present teacher. Lo Udes Beatriz Iraeta de Miranda. Lo Udes Beatriz. She's working. Luis Orlando Rodríguez Herrera. Yes, yes, working. Luis is there, but he's not. Yes, I'm here. Oh, okay, hey. Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Not here yet. Ofelia Oriana Arce. Pamela Beatriz Rosa, uh, Posada. Reina, hello, hello. Good evening, present. Hello, Rosa Elena Salgado de yes. Serrano. Present teacher. Hello, Sandra Gladys uh, Mendez Ramirez. Present teacher. Hello, Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Present. Hello. Hello. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Hello, good evening, present. Hello, good evening. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Good evening, present teacher. Good evening, Sol, uh, Suma Rosaura Lopez Garcia. Present. Hello. Flor de Maria Carvalho Garte. Present. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Not here yet. And the last one, Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. All right, very good, very good. Let me see. Okay, oh, Jose is here. Sorry, Jose. I didn't read your message. I just read, read it. All right, it's okay. Okay, guys, uh, just a quick reminder. Tomorrow is the last day. So if you can update, if you can update or catch up with the platform today, please do that. Okay, please do it because tomorrow is the last day. And we need to have everything ready or everything updated to uh, tomorrow. Okay, I just I just need that from you guys. And also and also the the exercise two point nine I think it is the one that had a, a mistake with the answer. It has already been fixed. If you go to the platform, you will find out that the exercise or the answer has been already uh, has already been fixed. So. Guys, excellent. And also remember that the survey is tomorrow. Be ready for that, okay? Tomorrow, everybody has to be here on time, not late, this is for Rosa, okay? No, tomorrow, people, it's very, very important for you to be here on time because uh, from English Corporativo, they give me, they give me the specific time to start with the survey. And it's not, it's not cool to start with the survey and then like to be in the middle when a person goes to class and wants to continue or do the, 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 the survey with us. So this person, no, well, that, that shouldn't happen. So guys, please be early, okay? And have, and have the link ready, okay? Yes. But as a backup, I'm gonna, I'm gonna share the link through the, the Zoom chat and also, it will be shared with you or to you on the WhatsApp group. So you will find it there too. Okay. Yes. All right. Is there anything that you would like to say before we start? Is there anything that you would like to say before we start? No, we're good. No, okay, we're good then. Guys, today we're going to be talking about strategies, strategies to, to engage employees, how we engage them and what tools or, or what we use to uh, engage them or to have them committed to what they are doing, all right? And uh, for that, we're gonna start, well, this is the, the, the topic, okay? Suggest strategies 
<clears throat> excuse me, suggest the strategies to promote employees engagement. Suggest the strategies to promote employees engagement. Today is class number 24. We finished tomorrow, as you know. Yes, we will be finishing today, but uh, uh, we skip a day. So that's why we're, not, we're gonna finish tomorrow. All right. And uh, I wanna show you something, some information, very interesting information about strategies and about engagement. Yes, and we're gonna start reading. Like I said, people, we have, we have a couple of things to read. There is a lot to read or a lot of reading today. So it's good, we're gonna practice more. Okay, guys, look at this. How to engage, how to engage. Guys, do you see the document? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, very good, excellent. Thank you very much. How to engage employees. How to engage employees. Let me read and then you guys will have the chance to read as well, okay? Just listen to, listen to the pronunciation and uh, take out take out any vocabulary or sentence that you do not understand. Let me read, hold on, but I need this, all right. One of the key factors to running a successful business is knowing how to engage employees. If the leaders of a business or organization understand the level of passion their workforce has for their job, they are a step ahead of competition, of the competition. As a manager, as a manager, you want your employees to have pride in what they do and in the company they work for. Those who work with purpose put forth their best efforts, a practice that can only benefit the goal of your organization. It's important to look at every aspect of why people do the work they do and why and what drives them to do it. If you are operating in a managerial position, getting to know your employees will be a key part to a successful evaluation of how engaged, engaged your staff is. From their background to their hobbies, skill sets, family life, all the aspects of your employees will end up becoming part of your workplace environment. Arming yourself with the knowledge on how to bend, sorry, how to blend that into a productive, positive environment is an important skill to have as a manager. Last paragraph says, ask yourself, just how much do my employees genuinely uh, care what happens to the company's future? Are they dedicated to helping it expand and be successful? If you aren't sure of the answer yet, it's okay. There are ways to determine the level of employee engagement among your staff, as well as lear learn how to engage employees. Okay. Is there a word that you don't understand from these paragraph people? Is there a word that you don't understand from here? We're good. Are we good, people? Yes? I think we are. Yes, teacher. Yes. All right. Well, I, I think there's one word that you might not know. And that word is this one. Uh, let me show you. You might not know what this word is or this combination of words. Put forth. You know, put forth this, guys. You know, what put forth this, put forth. No. Okay, put forth has the the same the same the same definition as purpose. Okay, with objective, with objective. Okay, that's what put forth means. Okay, with meaning. Or yeah, like like uh, how can I say this? Yeah, pretty much propose. Okay, propose. That's what it is. Okay. Effort, I will, I, teacher. Sorry. Effort. 
Ah, esfuerzo, effort. Yes. Okay. I would like a volunteer to read the first, the, just the first paragraph. Okay, me teacher, if okay, you want. Okay, go ahead, thank you. The first. <clears throat> one yes, of the key factors to running a successful business is knowing how to engage employees. If the leaders of a business or organization understand the level of passion their work faith, the, their workforce has for the job, they are a step ahead of the competition. Okay, thank you very much for reading it, Susan. Uh, Carla, can you read the second paragraph, Carla? Thank you. As a manager, you want your employees to have pride in what they do and in the company they work for. Those who work with purpose put forth their best effort. A practice that can only benefit the goal of your organization. It's important to look at at every aspect of why people do the work they do and what drives them to do it. All right, thank you very much for reading. Luis, are you there? Can you please help us read this one, the third paragraph? Uh, the one that starts with ask yourself? No, the one with the, if you are operating. Okay. If you are operating in a managerial position, getting to how to know your employees will be a key part of uh, part to a uh, successful evaluation of how engage your staff here from their backgrounds to their hobbies, the skill sets, family life, all the aspects of your employees will end up becoming part of your workplace environment. Arming yourself with the knowledge of how to blend that into a productive, positive environment is an important skill to have as a manager. All right, very good. Thank you very much for reading. Excellent, excellent. Thank you. I really appreciate, appreciate your uh, participation. Ada, read the last one, please. Ask yourself. Ask yourself just how much do my employees genuinely care what happened to the company's future? Are they dedicated to helping it expand and be successful? If you aren't sure of the answer yet, it's okay. Where are ways to determine the leave? Determine the leave. Deliver of employee engagement among your staff, as well as learn how engage employees. Okay, engage employees. All right, all right, very good. Thank you guys for reading. Now we're going to discuss the questions down here. There are four items or four things or four questions that we need to uh, discuss. And the first one is what is employee engagement? I would like to listen to a few, a few opinions. Okay, what is employee engagement, people? What do you think about this? What is employee engagement? You don't have to give me the right definition. What I want is your point of view or your definition. Guys, hello. Mm -hmm. Guys, me teacher. Hi. Hi. Uh, uh, I think that employee engagement is when the employee have the compromise with the company that they give an extra mile. Okay. That's what I think. All right, all right. Okay, okay, very good. Thank you very much for that. People continue. Give me more opinions. Uh, 
Um, I think the employee engagement is the the level that one employee have on their job and the dedication that they are put in their activities. Okay, all right, all right, very good, very good. Thank you very much, Gabriela, for your participation. One more, one more, one more participation. Just one more. There are 20 people today, so people. Hello. Engagement, yeah. em, employee engagement teacher is mm -hmm. the, the, the enthusiasm. Enthusiasm. That enthusiasm. Enthusiasm. Yes. <laughs> that the, the employee uh, put in all the all the things that uh, they do at work okay all right all right very good so employee engagement is reflected on the employee's performance okay if the performance is perfect or flawless that means that the engagement or the committed this person this person or this employee is committed okay to what he or she is doing okay so it all depends or uh you can tell when an employee is engaged or not by their performance there's a second question well there are three more questions the second question is what do employees need what do they need to feel engaged guys what do they need or what do we need as employees? What do we need to be or to feel engaged? Tell me. Motivation. Motivation, okay. But how, how can we get the motivation or how can we get that motivation that you're talking about? With your page, with benefits. Mm -hmm. With when your you pay, see the reality with... of where you live, it's not work in every place, maybe. Okay, okay, very good, very good. Guys, more opinions? Teacher. Yes, Hello. Good evening. I, I guess that the employees always, they are going to need to feel engaged. And uh, for example, a good salary, good condition in their workplace and get the, um, for example, the companies uh, have has to to give them the best of the condition to to receive a good job um, from um, the employee employees. Mm -hmm. Then, when the employee receive a good condition, maybe it is it is uh, it, the the result is going to be the best. Yes. Okay. okay, yes. Okay, very good, very good. Thank you, Wilfredo. Very good, very good. That's a nice insight. Oh, uh, all right. Anybody else? Guys? Well, we as employees need need a lot of things to be engaged or to feel engaged. Sometimes it is difficult to get engaged, sometimes it is easy. Okay, it depends on what on what benefits or what perks the company is offering you or giving you. Okay, yes. Teacher, sometimes uh, the company is very good, mm. but mm. you have a bad boss. Okay, the boss is, is the problem. Yeah, yes, sometimes it is, true. It, is yeah. true, it is true, you are right. You are completely right, okay. Very good, very good. The third question, people, the third question says, why is employee engagement important? This one is easy to answer and it's kind of obvious. I mean, the reason why this is important. So guys, why is employee engagement important? Tell me. I look super black. Look at this. <laughs> oh no. I need more, more, more light. I think the company needs people with, with, with proof of 
confiance. Confianza? How do you say confianza? Confidence. 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 Okay. For that. I think it's important for a company. Okay, okay. Very good, very good. It's important. All right, all right. Anybody else? Yes? Tell me. I think uh, that it is important because employees are the motor of the company, the, the, the engine, right? The engine, the engine. Of, of the company. And if the employees are feeling good, the company or the, the, the services that, that the employee or the company offers are gonna be really good. All right, all right, very good, very good. Okay, excellent, excellent, Julia. Thank you very much for your participation, your opinion. All right, let me see. Down here, there are people that have not said anything. I would like to get something from, from uh, Nelson. Nelson, could you give us your opinion about the importance, the importance of employee engagement and what that brings to, to the company? Apparently he's not available, which is okay, no problem. Okay, uh, Gloria, you Gloria, give us your opinion. Hi. 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 Yes. Uh, Gloria, there is there is some kind of interference, and I cannot really understand what you're saying. I couldn't understand what you said. I just heard uh, noise. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Very good. Uh, no problem. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, we're going to continue, guys. Thank you for your uh, participation. Okay, so employee engagement, it's a very important or one of the, uh, the most crucial aspects that a company needs or that all employees need. Okay, yes. If employees are not engaged, that means there won't be enough or there won't be a good performance or productivity in the company, okay? That's what this is all about. Now we're going to continue and now we're gonna see or read, read more information about this. We're gonna read more information about this. Here. All right, let's start, let's start. Look, employee engagements, employee engagement. Like I said, there is a lot of reading today. There's a lot of reading, so we're going to read a lot. I have some, uh, how can I say this? Some characteristics or some strategies, some strategies to have or to keep your employees engaged or to make them feel engaged. And one of them is this one, get to know them, get to know them. Let me read, then we will practice with you guys. Get to know them, sounds simple and it is. Spending time with your employees and getting to know them. Oh, no. So it's okay, no problem, no problem. Let me read again. It says, get to know them. Sounds simple, and it is. Spending time with your employees and getting to know them is an easy and effective way to change, sorry, to engage, to engage employees. Learning about their families, backgrounds, and personal goals enables you as a manager to develop a stronger rap rapport with them. Find time in the day to say hello 
and asked them how their family are do families are doing and in inquired about their hobbies. This is a quick and straightforward practice that can make your employee feel like their presence is known and that you care about them as an individual. Research shows that employees who feel valued tend to be much more engaged in their work and performance. Guys, is there a word that you don't understand from the paragraph? It's straightforward. Straightforward, direct. Something that is direct. Mm -hmm. or, labels, honest. I don't remember. Yes. Sorry, which one? Enables. I don't remember what is I mean. Enables. Enables. Like habilita. Habilita. Yes. What else, people? Teacher, a stronger raptor. Okay, hold on. Let me mark them. They are important. Okay, we got a few over here. We got a uh, report over here. Straightforward. And uh, enables. Enables means habilitar. Okay, yes. Report means, uh, how can I say this in Spanish? Like when you're... Uh, how can I say this, man? It's the way you, well, the confidence, the level of confidence, the level of confidence you have with the person. Okay, you will be de developing a stronger, a stronger confidence with the person. That's rapport. And straightforward is uh, honest, sincere, and uh, direct. Okay. Let me rapport is is when you have a llevarse bien llevarse bien con alguien rapport. But hope, let me find the right word in Spanish. It's called what? In Spanish is a uh, yeah good relation, buena relación. It says here, yes. En sinton, in sintonía, in sintonía. Like there is connection, so that's what what it means. Okay, very good, very good. Uh, thank you, thank you very much. Now. Let me see people that have not really participated. Flor, are you available, Flor? Flor, are you there? Hello. Hello, teacher. Flor, have fun. <laughs> Read. Okay. Uh, read. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, please. I get get to know them mm -hmm. so simple and it is spending time with your employees and get, getting to know them is an easy and effective to enjoy employees learning about their families backgrounds and personal goals Enables. Enables. You, enables. Enables. You have a manager to develop a stronger rap rapport with stronger. them. Stronger. Stronger. Yes. Go on. Go on. Mm -hmm. Stronger oh. <laughs> raptor with them. Find time in the. They to say hello, ask them how their families are doing or inquire about their, their hobbies. This is a quick, a quick and a straight forward. Straightforward. Straightforward practice that can make your employees feel like their present is now and that you care about them as an individual. 
Okay. Continue. Research. 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 Shows. Shows that shows that employees who feel valued. Valued. And valued then then to be much more engaged in their work and performance. In their work and performance. In their work and performance. Guys, I have a question for you. The question is, let me show it to you. The question will be projected there. Okay, and the question is this. Do you agree with this? Guys, do you agree with this? What you have read? Yes? Yes, for me, teach. Okay, okay. Very good, very good. Okay. Guys, do you agree with this information? Yep. Okay, very good, very good. Thank you, thank you very much. Let's continue, there's, there's more, there's more. Provide them with the tools for success. Provide them with the tools for success. As a manager, you not only have to oversee different facets of business, but you should be sure your employees understand what they are doing. Training within their specific job descriptions can offer them more confidence in what they are doing. When one of the team members is unsure of what to do or how to handle a situation, productivity can, be, can come to a grinding hold, to a grinding hold while they try to troubleshoot the situation. If it becomes too overwhelming, there is a possibility of a small hitch becoming a much larger problem. Even if additional coaching or training is needed, providing your employees with a strong foundation for, their ta for the tasks ahead is a good step for towards raising their level of engagement. Is there a word that you don't understand from the paragraph, people? Tell me. Guys, hello. Hello. Mm -hmm. No, we're good. Mm, grinding. Grinding, grinding. Grind. Extremely, extremely. It means absolutely. Uh, and also, how do you say this, like, uh, when something is too much for you? Agobiante, that's the word. Yes. That's grinding, grinding. Okay. Troubleshoot. Sorry? Troubleshoot. Troubleshoot, what is it? Uh, well, they try to tro troubleshoot. Troubleshoot. Troubleshoot means when there is a... How can I say this? When there is a problem and you're trying to find the solution to this problem, yeah, pretty much solve or resolve. Yeah, yeah, resolve. Solution. Yes, uh -huh. give, give it the solution, yes. Resolve or solve, that's troubleshoot, yes. Teacher. Yes. In, in my company, when we have some trouble with my, when the machine doesn't work, mm -hmm. and I remember, uh, 15 years ago mm -hmm. um, and department engineer department mm -hmm. tried to do a troubleshooting it is like a this situation troubleshooting to solve a um, kind of problem mm -hmm. that machine could be present yes. um, when when an operator for example asking for help and I remember in, in this year, uh, we have a, a little manual. Mm -hmm. And we, we have to read what can we do 
uh, for for example to solve um, any uh, any any problem that the machine could present okay okay i get it now i'll get it now okay very good very good yeah that that, that happens you know sometimes uh, yeah okay more work people more words we have a few words here that are kind of a new or over 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 we got, harm. We got these two words we have troubleshoot we have uh oh, overwhelming means overwhelming is the word that you cannot it's when you cannot handle a situation I can't remember the word in Spanish. This is why. Abrumado. Exactly, abrumante, abrumante. Yes, thank you, thank you, Luis. Abrumante, that's what it is. Okay, when you cannot handle uh, what is happening, you, you cannot handle the pressure, you cannot handle the situation, or the problem is too big or too complicated or too complex, that, that overwhelms you. Okay, yes. Hold means pause, okay, or stop. It's a pause or a stop. Guys, let me tell you that it is raining really hard over here. <laughs> I don't know if you guys if you can hear the rain, but it yes, is raining you really can, hard. You can hear it. We're raining. Okay, it is raining. Give me a second. I need my my my. Hold on. Any microphone is producer in the sound. Could be. Okay, I'm back. It was hard. It was kind of hard to find them. I need to put them on. Hold on, give me a second. It's kind of difficult to be like this. Where do you live, Mari? Guys, do not talk because I cannot hear you. I cannot hear anything. Did you stop the, 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 the raining teacher? I want to talk here. Do you guys hear me? Can you guys hear me? Yes. 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 And the feel about the song. Don't, don't scream. Don't scream. Oh. <laughs> that was loud. That was loud. Okay. Do you, do you hear me clearly? Yes. Yes, teacher, yes, but teacher. I have yes, the teacher. feedback. You have what, sorry? I'm feedback, the sound. Oh, it's different. Oh, it sounds different. OK, guys, let's continue with this. So I, we're talking about something, right? And it was just, this is what we're talking about. OK, guys, uh, well, I already read this. Sentence or paragraph. Is there a volunteer that would like to read? Is there a volunteer that would like to read? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you. Go ahead, read, please. Okay. Employee engagement. Provide them with the tools for success. As a manager, you not only have to oversee different facets of business, but you should be sure your employees understand what they are doing. Training within their specific job descriptions can offer them more confidence in what, in what they're doing. When one of your team members is unsure of what to do or how to handle a situation, productivity can come to a grinding halt while, while they try to troubleshoot the situation. If it becomes too overwhelming, there is a possibility of a small hitch 
becoming a much larger problem. Even if additional coaching or training is needed, providing your employees with a strong foundation for the task ahead is a good step towards raising their level of engagement. All right, all right, very good. Thank you, Elena, for reading. Guys, do you agree on this? Do you agree on this? Yeah. Yes? Okay. There are like there are two more, more things to read here. Uh, okay, this one. Let them know, let them know how the company is doing. Let them know how the company is doing. Okay, that's another one. Okay, here we go. It says here, they are the backbone of the enterprise, and many times it's success or failure will depend on them. For them to have a vested interest or in the weather, the business does well, they should. They should be made aware of its successes, concerns, and the struggles. Provide employees with a briefing, with a briefing of not only the company's uh, fruitful ventures, but also the ones that didn't work out so well. Allow your team to know what works and what doesn't. Grant them to grant them the opportunity to develop new ideas for the weaker areas and continue to be proactive. In the sectors they are work that are working. Okay, uh, guys, do you have any questions about this vocabulary here? Guys, briefing teacher. I don't know right. with the is the correct pronunciation. Right. Briefing. What what is that? Provide employees with briefing. Briefing. Oh, briefing. 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 Okay. briefing. Yes, it's briefing. Yes, guys. More words. Hello. We're good. Struggles. Struggles. Strong, strong, strong. Luchas, luchas. Strong. Okay. Luchas, yes. That's what it is. I hear you when you say what is a mean briefing. A uh, briefing. I can hear you. Yes, you I cannot, can hear you. You cannot hear me. No, can you repeat, please? Wait, what is a mean? Uh, it's raining left now. Hold on, hold on. Let me change the, the microphone. Hold on. Yes, I do. Okay, guys, can you hear me now? Yes, okay. Yes, sir. It is it is raining less. It is raining less. Okay. So you were saying ah briefing. Briefing is a, a summary, a resuming. Yes. Okay. Let me choose a person from here that has not really participated uh, whatsoever. Okay, Pamela, are you available to read? Yes, I can. Employee engagement. Oh, but your microphone is giving you problems, right? I remember. Uh, well, I can try. Well, I hear nothing from you. <laughs> okay, no problem. Uh, let me see. Let me choose another person. Guadalupe, are you available? Are you there? Yes, teacher. Guadalupe, hello. I'm here. Hello. You're, you're not available? Yes. I'm available. No? Okay, then no problem. Mauricio, I know you are available. Okay. Is available. You have problem with your micro. I have read. Okay. 
Nelson, are you there? Can you help us read? Yeah. Employee engagement. Let them know how the company is doing. They are the backbone of the enterprise. Okay, nobody. And Guys, anytime. me escuchan. Yes. Okay. Because <laughs> I've been like trying to choose people, but they are not replying. You know, getting back at me. Okay, Sandra, you know, listen, are you there? Teacher, teacher, you know, listen. Teacher, hello. No. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, a person, a volunteer, guys. Hey, <laughs> teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Guys, me escuchan, no me escuchan. Yes. Yes, I hear you. Yes. I hear you very well. You're not mm, here. Okay, okay, okay. This is what happens when you change the whole thing. Guys, hear me better now? No? Yes. No, it's better. Yes. Yes, teacher. Teacher, maybe you can't hear with us. Hi. Hi, teacher. Hi. Hi. Uh, I don't know what is happening with this thing. Se escucha lejos. <laughs> what happened, teacher? See, I'm, I'm having, I'm having problems with the, with the audio, with everything. So I don't really know what is happening. Yeah. Okay. But can you guys hear me? I can hear you. I can hear you now. What you let me Se escucha, pero un poco lejos. Oh, par, no. teacher, par. Okay. Bueno, voy a gritar entonces. Voy a gritar. I'm going to scream. <laughs> you hear me now? Yes? Yes, yes teacher. Yes. yes. No, It's sorry. a card, teacher. <laughs> okay. I was just trying. No, I was just testing you. Right? Okay. Very good. I'm sorry, guys, for that inconvenience. Uh, I apologize. You know, it happens. Technology is like that. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Okay, here. Well, uh, we were reading this information, and I was asking for uh, help in this paragraph. So, guys, what do you... Guys, who wants to read? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you. Read, please. Okay, uh, employee engagement. Let them know how the company is doing. 
they are the backbone of the enterprise and many times it's success or failure will depend on them for them to have a best a vested interest in the in the weather the business does well they should be made aware of its success concerns and struggles provide employees with a briefing of not only the company's fruitful ventures but also the ones that didn't work out so well allowing your team to know what works and what doesn't grant them the opportunity to develop new ideas for the web for, for the weaker areas and continue to be proactive in the sectors that are that are working okay okay very good thank you julia julia for reading thank you very much for that all right let's continue with the next one that are this i think this is the last one it says allow them to grow allow them to grow okay hold on Allow them to grow. You sat down with them for an interview and sat, and sorry, and saw potential in their abilities to help your business grow. The team you assembled was chosen for a reason. Now, as a manager, you need to give them the opportunity to show off this, their skills and ability to do their, their assigned task. Give them the room to branch out to do their job the best way they know how. Hover, hovering and uh, micromanaging is only going to result in add stress. And that is a condition that no one can work well under. If an employee comes to you with a pitch or an idea that may not be what you are looking for, choose to respond in a way that won't discourage them from continuing to try and develop other concepts offering and offering encouragement and appreciation for the work is important even more so uh, when you may reject their first pitch okay guys is there a question about this vocabulary paragraph Hello. Hovering. Hovering. Uh, hovering. Hovering. That's what, what did it? What did the mean? That's the pronunciation. Hovering. All right. Hover. 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 Hover is the verb. Okay. That means. That means. Well, it has different different uh, uh, definitions. One of them, one of them is moderate, moderate, moderate. And also, you can say uh, when you are hesitating or thinking about something. Okay, well, do that. Okay, do that. Do that. That's what it is. And micro mining. Micro, my, it's micromanaging, micromanaging. Man, micromanaging. Yes, micromanagement. That means, that means when you are, uh, when there, there are managers, okay, there are managers in different companies that they pressure you, they put pressure on you and they keep pressuring you, you know, it's this type of manager that is always there, you know, by your children telling you what to do or like telling you to hurry up. Right? That's what that's what micromanaging is. It's like like when the pressure not demasiado, like too much pressure. Yes, that's what it is. Thank you, teacher. Or like 
like when a manager wants to control you, but in a very excessive way, he goes over the limits. Okay. You guys, what else? Pitch, pitch, teacher. Pitch, pitch. Yes, pitch has different pitch. definitions. It has different definitions. One of them is cancha or, or like campo, okay, uh, in sports, okay. But but in this case, in this case, it's like saying uh, like uh, idea, opinion, like an idea or a plan. An idea or a plan, that's what it is. An idea, an idea or a plan. More questions, people? Hello? More questions? Hovering. Hover. Hovering. Hovering. Hover. Hover. Hovering. Yes. What was that? That's not, what was it? I told you what, what it was. Let's see the two dog clothes. Hovering? No? Hesitated. Do that. Dudando. That's what hover is. But it has different, different definitions of it. Yes. And also, uh, like, well, in this context, we can say that hovering is when the person, when the manager is like walking around, okay, monitoring, but he's walking around to show his authority. Okay, now, since time is, time is advancing, we're going to uh, look for a person to read. Who wants to read? Guys? Who wants to read? Nobody wants to read? Hey, me? Thank you for offering. Allow them to rob. You sat down with them for an interview and saw poten potential in their abilities to help your business grow. The team you've assembled was chosen for a reason. Now, as their manager, you need to give them the opportunity to show, show off their skills and abilities to do their assigned task, give them the room to branch out to do their jobs the best way they know how. Hovering and micromanagement, micromanagement is only going to result is in other stress and that a condition that no one can work well under, if an employee comes to with a pitch or an idea, that may not be what you are looking for. Choose the respond in a way that won't discourage them from continuing to try and develop other concepts, offering encouragement and appreci appreciating for their work eh, is important. Even more so when you may reject their first speech. We can hear you, teacher. No. Now, do you hear me? Yes. yes. Okay, sorry. Yes. yes. I'm going to destroy this computer. But tomorrow, because tomorrow we finish, so I'm going to. <laughs> yes. Since you guys have money, you can get me a new computer. Yes, thank you guys. 
I will really appreciate that. <laughs> okay, very good. Guys, can you mention more, more ideas to engage employees? Can you mention more ideas to engage your employees? We have read a couple of those, but uh, I wanna hear your, your ideas. Tell me. Mm -hmm. Guys, more communication. Sorry, <laughs> teacher. More communication. Put put attention. Ah, uh, employees. Okay, more daily, daily conversation in eh, confianza. Con Confidence. Confidence, okay, more communication uh, yes, yes. and confidence. Okay, okay, very good, very good. Thank you for sharing. What do you say, Luis? I'm sorry, didn't catch it. Uh, having individual meetings or one-on-ones to show them some interest, uh, interest in, in about. Having individual meetings, you said? Yes, or one-on-one. Okay, or... One sessions, okay, to show that they are important. Okay, okay, very good. Let me make this smaller, this is too big. Okay, guys, what else? We have two over here. What other ideas can you mention? Stability in the work. Sorry? Stability in the work. Okay. That'll be job stability. Okay, job stability. What else? Provide provide staff development opportunities. Development opportunities okay okay what else what else people i feel appreciate or be the company feel appreciated Feel appreciated, what else? For the company, uh -huh. yeah. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Yeah. If, you, if the company have a good reputation? Mm -hmm. No, I don't know if it works. Mm -hmm. Okay, the company. Okay, the company status. All right. What else? It is said, establish a great work environment. Sorry? Establish a great work environment. Okay, establish a great a great work environment. All right, all right. What else? Give the employee the opportunity to express their ideas and queries without fear. The chance to give their ideas. And what do you say? What else? And uh, the, the chance to express their, uh, their ideas or doubts without fear. Those without what? Without fear. Sin miedo. Fear, okay, without fear. All right. Can you mention more? Guys, can you mention more? I have constant um, training in the area or, have, or the personality. What? Sorry, have what? Con continue, constant, constant 
training or coaching and and the and the work or the personal okay have constant constant training hold on there is something happening here in on the ceiling a little weird all right okay we can stop here we can continue you know, like like uh, expressing more ideas there are a lot more ideas to express thank you guys and there are many things that we can say that can improve you know the the the, the employees engagement i have some over here recognize your team and their hard work encourage teamwork among employees find employees that care about the customer listen to and act on employee feedback create a workplace environment free of fear that's what you guys were saying motivate inspire and coach your employees let them know yeah let them show you how well they can lead and the last one is encourage their personal developments okay yes very good now we're going to have a quick a quick uh, review of this subordinate clauses but we're going to put uh, a little bit more emphasis on the ones that you have over there like certainly naturally of course it is true to be sure in granite okay we're gonna have some examples with that too. Okay, guys, uh, do you know these words? The ones that are in the chart, do you know them? After, although, as, because, before, even if, even though, even, uh, if, in order that, in order that, once, provided that, rather that, since, so that, then, that, though, unless, until, when, whenever, where, whereas, who, whether, while, and which, do you know them all? Yes. Okay. Is there? Do you want me to give you an example with this with these ones? Well, I will. I will give you some examples. Okay. Remember that these 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 words, these words that you see here, they are called subordinate clauses because they join or connect two different sentences. Okay. They connect two sentences. Okay, one sentence is very much the opposite of the other one. Okay, and they are not, they are not like the same, all right? They, uh, but in some of them. For example, for example, you need to practice English so that you can express yourself with Americans, okay? Look at this example, okay? It says, you need to practice English so that you can express yourself with Americans. So that you can express yourself with Americans. Guys, how do you say so that in Spanish? Para que? Okay, yes, yes, okay. Yes, that's what it is. We have so that over there, okay? Yes, very good, very good. Another example can be, the boss will go to the meeting, okay, until you print out the agenda. Okay. The boss will go to the meeting until you print out the agenda. Okay. Yes, see, that's how we use until. Now, let's focus on the words that we have over there. Certainly. Guys, how do you say certainly in Spanish? Ciertamente. Sorry? Ciertamente. All right. Ciertamente. Yes. Yes, yes. Okay. We use certainly, 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 not certainly, okay? Certainly. All right. We use certainly with uh, with these words, the words that you see, like certainly, naturally, of course, it is true or to be sure or granted. We use uh, a lot of punctuation. So we need to be very careful with this thing, okay? Because we use, we use uh, a lot of, uh, a lot of, uh, punctuation here 
for example, I can say, I will, sorry, let's say, the manager will, the manager will certainly, will certainly help his Okay, look, the manager will certainly help his employees grow. Okay, yes, that's that's uh one one of them. Okay, yes. Right. So that's that's one one use of certainly, or we can say we can use certainly at the beginning of the sentence. We can say certainly you are allowed to send reports every single day okay certainly certainly you are allowed to send reports every single day guys how do you say certainly in this case how do you say certainly in this case in this case certainly means of course you can change that to of course you are permitted to send reports every single day. Okay, look at that. Of course you are permitted to send reports every single day, but we need to use the comma there, you know. Of course, you are permitted to send reports every single day, or certainly you are allowed to send reports every single day, okay? Yes, that's, that's how we use it, okay? Yes. Guys, how do you say to be sure in Spanish and granted? Oh, you know what? It is true. It is true. Guys, how do you say to be sure or granted in Spanish? Mm -hmm. People, no, you don't know? No, teacher. Granted is garantizado or granted, granted, garantizado. Yes, okay. Mm -hmm. Oficialmente, en realidad, okay. Claramente, ciertamente, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, but look, we're gonna go to the book and we're going to see examples in the book. I think in that way you will get it better or understand it better. Let me close this thing here. All right, here we go. Okay, look, look at this. We have how to use transitions of concession. Look at examples in the box, then complete the exercises below. Use expressions like certainly, naturally, of course, it is true to be sure and granted to express concession. Use a comma after these words if they are at the beginning of the sentence. To be sure, try to promote good relations at work. Okay. To be sure, comma, try to promote good relations at work. Then we have the other one. Use a comma before and after the transition if it is between two clauses. For example, Feeling valued at the organization is, of course, a crucial factor for employee engagement to grow. Okay. Now, as you can see, that's how we use those words, but I'm going to give you some other examples to understand it better. Okay. Yes. Over here, we can also say, we can also say, to, oh, sorry. You can also say to ensure yourself. Okay, that's another word that is not included here or here, down here. To ensure yourself, try to promote good relationships, relations at work. Okay, we can also use it at the beginning. Okay, yes, we can use it like that. All right. And In the uh, meaning, teacher. Sorry? The meaning to ensure yourself? Oh, para asegurarte tú mismo. 
para que estés más seguro o para que estés seguro. To ensure yourself or to be sure it's not. It's the same thing. The same thing. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Look. Let's let's use let's use uh, uh to be sure in the begin in the middle. Sorry. Tomorrow, I am going to. I am to be sure. Check the list of. Sorry. What? Okay, look, tomorrow I am to be sure. Going to check, sorry. Going to check the list of missing items. Maybe my watch is there. Okay. So in Spanish will be mañana para yo, para estar seguro, chequearé o voy a revisar la lista de los objetos perdidos. Maybe my watch is there. Okay. As you can see, to be sure, to be sure can be used in the middle of the sentence, but you need to separate them with the comma. Okay. That to be sure word or expression is not really necessary. Okay. It's just you're adding adding that that thing over there because you want to add some concession to the sentence. Okay. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Yes. Or you can you can uh, to ensure myself, you can say as well. Okay, to ensure myself. Okay. That's uh you can do that too. Or you can eliminate this and you can just simply say tomorrow I am going to check the list of missing items. Maybe my watch is there. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's how it is. All right. It's kind of easy to understand. Guys, let's continue down here with the with the exercises. So we have an exercise down here. And uh it's pretty simple, pretty simple. Look at it. It says, read the following strategies to keep employees engaged at work. Add the missing punctuation, just the punctuation, okay? You're not going to uh, 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 like add the words. You're just gonna add the commas. Add the missing punctuation when necessary. Check answers with a partner. We have six examples, well, five. The first one is already done. To be sure, comma, employees must be able to move past through their workplace. Right, guys, continue. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yes.
Did you guys finish? Sorry. <laughs> I have to do something right now. Let me know when you finish, please. Please, please, people. I'm just trying to show you what I'm what we're gonna do after you're done with that. Guys, did you finish? Yes, we're done. Yes. Okay, let's let's read. Okay, if you have uh, placed a comma in the in between the sentences, mention the comma in that way. I will know that you used it. Okay, a volunteer. The second one. Me, teacher. Thank you. All right, number two, employees could get frustrated, comma. Granted, comma, they have to remember too many passwords to access an area. That's not good. <laughs> All right. It, it's okay. I mean, not good because you have to remember a lot of passwords. But thank you for, for uh, reading. Okay. Comma and comma. Uh, another person, another volunteer to read number three. Yes, Luis, read, please. Thanks. Sure. Naturally, comma, it is important to know as much as possible about personal tendencies and needs of each employee to generate engagement. Okay. Naturally, comma, it's important to know as much as possible about the personal tendencies and needs of each employee to generate engagement. Thank you for reading. Uh, and yes, Naturally, comma. Okay, number four, guys. Can you read number four? Me, teacher. Okay. Okay. There are many ways for a company to let its employees know that they are uh, they are important. Comma, of course, comma. One of these ways is to offer constant training and learning. All right. There are many ways to for a company to let its employees know that they are important, of course. I mean, comma, of course. One of them, one of these ways is to offer constant trainings and learning. Thank you very much for reading. Number five, anybody with number five? Guys, hello. Hey, me, teacher. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Go ahead. Get feedback from your employees. And certainly, comma, are on this knowledge to solve engagement deficiency. Okay, it says get feedback from your employees and uh, comma, certainly, add on 
this knowledge to solve engagement mm -hmm. deficiencies. Now, the last one is number six. Anybody, a volunteer to read number six? I love people. I can do this, the last one, I understand. Sorry? I can do the last one, I understand. Where you, don't come. you don't understand the last one? Yes, I understand. Okay, can you read it then? Read it, read it. It is through promoting closer connection among colleagues help them care more about their workplace. Okay, it is through come on, promoting closer connections among the colleague, colleagues helps them care more about their workplace. Thank you very much for reading. Now we're going to stop here. Look at part number six. It says identify strategies your company implements to promote employee engagement. Then it says think of how effective they are. Organize a presentation about additional strategies to maximize employee engagement at your workplace. But we're going to do it a little different over here, okay? We're gonna have groups. We're going to have groups. I'm gonna show you how we're gonna do it. Look at this. You can use Microsoft Word to do that. Look, I have this. Identify strategies your company uh, implements to promote employee engagement. That's the topic. And in the first part, look at this, guys. In the first part, we have, uh, we have the strategy, as you can see, the strategy is there. You are going to write down the strategy here in the space. For example, uh, the company has conversation clubs, let's say. It's an example, okay? Conversation clubs to improve Employee, employees interaction, okay? That's what I want, that's what I want. I want you guys to identify the strategies your company, your company implements, but, but we're going to have different strategies. For example, here, hi. You're going to place your name here. For example, we can say Susan. Okay, look, it's like in and uh, in Susan's company. This is what uh, this is what happens, and Susan will tell you because this is uh, also a discussion. Susan will tell you how effective this this strategy is. Okay, and she's going to uh, write a check here. Okay, a check in the spaces. Okay, I check in the spaces. It says flawless performance. Okay, flawless performance. It means that the, that the strategy is really, really good. Here we have really effective, here effective, partly effective, not effective and step back. What you're going to do is this. You're going to go to each of them and you're going to place a check if you think that the strategy is good. If you think that is bad, you're gonna go over here or you can use the other one or you can use an X like this, okay? Yes, people, do you understand? Yes. You can change this. You can change the information that is up here. This is my idea, okay? You can change this, all right? You can change it, all right? Yes. But the strategy has to go like this and you have to put your name down there to see, because I, I want everybody to give or to participate, you know? So everybody has to participate and give their own strategy, okay? Yes, all right. So, but people, let us let me create the groups and we're gonna go over there. But we're, we're not gonna have a lot of groups, just five. In each group, there are going to be five people, okay? So you have enough, enough uh, brain cells. You have enough brain cells to do a very good job. Let's go. I will give you a 15 minutes exactly, 15. 
minutes exactly. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop this at 9.50, okay? At 9.50, I will stop and I will bring you back to the main session, okay? Yes, people? How okay. many strategies, teacher? Sorry? How one, many strategies? One per member. If there are five members in the group, ah, five strategies. Ah. It's one, one per each student. Okay. That's why, that's why I was telling you that you need to include your name right right down uh right below the the, the the strategy okay yes okay yes all right let's let's go people i will be helping you okay go 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 use microsoft word Wendy, Wilfredo, are you guys there? Could you please join the groups? I will really appreciate if you do so. I would really appreciate if you appreciate it if you did so. Thank you. Uh, let me join one of them. Hey guys, I'm here. <laughs> Nobody. Hey, Maurice, uh, Hi, teacher. do you have the template? I do, but I don't know how to share it with you all. Uh, well, I just did it in, like, in like, like a minute, so you can do your own, but I can show it to you in that way you can uh, uh, see how it is. Look at this. It's really simple. If you want, you can like remove one of these things. You, this one I think is, is, is not really necessary to much info. That, that would be better. Okay, really effective, effective, partly effective, not effective, and uh, needs, needs improvements, needs improve. Okay, there you go, improvement. But let me see if I can share this with you in the, uh, through the Zoom chat. Let me save it and I will share it with you. Hold on, Thank just give me a minute. Too much. <laughs> I think I need a new laptop. This laptop, sometimes it runs slowly. Okay, let me share it with you. Let me know if you, if you, if you get it, okay? Did you guys get it? It's in the chat. No. Okay. Since you are only four people here, you can you can uh well you're gonna have just four four strategies, okay? Yes. Okay. Yes. You uh once once you you're done sharing your strategy or talking about it your your classmates can help you or can give you opinions their own opinions and can they can help you vote okay on how effective this strategy is okay yes so guys work please i will i'll be back yes, yes. I see the accent. Okay. 
Strategy. 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 Str
It does. Yes. Because, because every employee in the morning, every employee wants to drink, wants to drink coffee. Yes. yes. That's all we want. Every yeah. employee needs a coffee machine at the company, and we, we have to drink coffee in the morning. Yes. And if the, if the coffee yes. is bad, no, no, brother, the morning is bad for the employees. <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> no coffee, <laughs> no work. <laughs> The right. results. <laughs> no coffee, no work, therefore, no results. <laughs> yes. Uh, on Mondays, coffee is really necessary. Monday, why? Monday, no. Monday is, is, is the best day of the week. All days. All no. days. is right every day. All days. <laughs> yes. Right, guys, continue. You are only three, okay. so that means you're gonna have only three strategies, okay? Go ahead. Okay. Oh, um, if you, Julia, you're going to write the first one, okay? Julia, ask Lourdes and Nelson to give to give you their opinion about the, the how uh, about how effective the, the strategy is, but you have to describe it, okay? You have to describe it, and they will help you uh, with, with their opinion, okay? Okay. The okay. Sugar, yes. uh, in that in that case, if if Julia said the company don't have a good strategy, uh, Julia said bad strategy the have of the company and the strategy, for example, is not effective, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Or step back. But in a step back, uh -huh. change it, change it, please, and put and put over there needs improvement, needs improvement. Mm -hmm. uh, needs improvement. Uh -huh. Yes. Yeah, so and teacher, better. what is the meaning? Flawless. Flawless. Perfect. Flawless. <laughs> Perfect. Come? Perfect. Um, okay. Flow. Flow is is on a deficit. Deficit. Perfection. That's flaw. Mm -hmm. flaw. And flawless. Okay. Yes. Perfectamente. It's the opposite, exactly. Yes. Flawless mm -hmm. performance. Okay, okay, guys, continue. Let me go to another group. There are just four groups. So, this sure. group. yes, yes. Tell me. Uh, uh, and one is a strategy uh, mm -hmm. could be establish a read board environment. Establish a what, sorry? A read board environment. Oh, you have to give me the, the, the point is this you have to give me the strategy but but you have to explain how it works and, uh, mm -hmm. and uh, Lourdes and Julia will tell you if they are if the strategy is effective or not mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes only oh. Nelson, you say the strategy, and exactly. Julia and me uh, verify if the strategy is effective or no. Okay. And the same case is in Julia and me. For example, Julia was talking about the coffee machine, or the, that the coffee being bad. We could, we could say that that uh, the coffee is a strategy, you know, because it is. Mm -hmm. It is that strategy keeps employees happy. Okay, happy and comfortable. Mm -hmm. But what happens if the if this if this uh, benefit is bad? So it's not effective. That, mm -hmm. Exactly. So that means that it's it, not effective. It's a depend the perception. Mm -hmm. exactly, exactly. So guys, continue. Let me go to another group. Thank okay. you. Yes. Thank you. Hi guys, are you here? <laughs> Is this what happened, Gloria? Jose is not available. No, no problem. You, no problem. You can do it on, on, your, on your notebooks. That's not a problem. Okay. You can do it on your notebooks. The teacher is. Um... It's complicated when when the, we 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 do not 
participate. Participate. Uh, we don't. We do not um, have microphone or camera activate, or only two college uh, participants. It's complicated. It's complicated. Yes, it is. Yes, I know. I understand your point. All right. Bye. <laughs> Guys, it is it is time. I told you, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop the the the, the activity at at nine fifty, and it is nine fifty two actually. So I'm gonna go to the last group, and then I'm going to stop you, and I'm gonna take you back to the main session. Yes, I um, I can hear you better now. Um, okay, thank you. Um, for example, I I I, am, I I want to ask you if if in your company has us. Uh, talking about problem or trouble you have you have some minute to solve it yes for example when the general manager the owner of the company comes to the warehouse and they uh, uh, oh my god i forgot the word regaño oh. what cold oh. oh it's cold yeah when she's call us uh, you have to make a meeting after that we make a meeting uh, a meeting and we talk about the situation uh, um with uh, my boss tell us uh, okay we need to do this we need to do better this one forget this do this in that way and for the moment or, or for a, a few days uh, that have effective and we made the, the things better uh, for us it's, it's it's good to to have a meeting a meeting every every week to talk about the situations uh, the problems things what we can change or the strategy think, yeah Mm -hmm. yes. yes, I think that is the I, best way. I guess, Roxa, that it is the, depends, for example, if the, 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 it, it, it is depends uh, about the frequency. Yeah. Because uh, in, my, in my company, in, um, I work in a, in a factory, uh, textile, textile manufacturing. Okay. Then we have to, we have to check quality every day, every hour, because my boss always every two hours they are called called us called us and what happened i i the quality department report me report me and for example a mistake or defect in the garment and then we have to go and to the have a meeting a little meeting with a team the um, um, in my company, we have a equipo de alto rendimiento teamwork. Oh my God. Sorry. I'm um, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, no problem. We, we can, um, but, we can yeah. explain in the, in the main <laughs> session. Okay. okay. No, no, over there in the main session, we can go back to the main session. Okay. okay. Over there. Yeah. Let's go back. Hi guys, I am, how do you call a pitufo? Look at my, I'm blue. <laughs> I look blue people. Really blue. Okay, I'm back. Now my, my wall, okay, now I, yeah, I'm a pitufo. <laughs> people, look at this. I don't know what is happening with this thing, you know, but it's, it's been acting weird. Okay, it's back to normal. Okay, we have a few minutes left, so we're going to share. We're going to share what we did. Okay, don't worry if you didn't finish. If you have only one or, or only two strategies, don't worry. Okay, that's okay. All I want is your participation. Okay, who wants to share? Who wants to share? If you want, thank you, group, thank you very much. Thank you very much. 
Okay. This is our presentation. It's Carla, Walter, and Sandra. Okay. Uh, the, first strategy, the first strategy is keep communication open and fluid. And fluid. Uh, for me, it, this strategy is very important because it's the principal strategy in all companies. It's really effective, but, but too need improvement because it's very necessary to maintain uh, that strategy and better the strategy. All right, all right. And you did a very good one. Excellent, excellent. Okay, continue. Okay. The second is in my company, additional benefits are promoted. I think it's a good strategy, it's very effective, but I think he, I think it needs improvement. Mm -hmm. Okay, in my company, and employees of the more recognition. In my, in my company, all the people is uh, very losing you. The key, uh, strategy, and all the people uh, as for, uh, as for uh, uh, we had uh, the recognizing the more employees. All right, all right. Sandra, the, build the celebration every month in my company or the, all the, the month. Uh, I think is uh, is not effective. Mm -hmm. I need improvements mm -hmm. for solution the problem the company. Okay. Yes. All right, very good, very good. I see, but you did a, you did a very good one. Okay, and, and we can see which ones are effective and not. It can be effective and not at the same time, okay? Effective for a group of people and, and not effective for another group of people. Thank you guys for sharing. Another, another group to share, please, thanks. Is there another group that would like to share? I'm waiting. People, hello. It's 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 Wednesday. You're sleepy. Are you sleepy? We finish tomorrow, guys. So we it's have, for vacation, teacher. It's for vacation. It's almost uh, exactly. It's almost vacation. All right. Okay then. Uh, Wilfredo, I don't remember who you were working with, but can you share? With, with Rosa. Okay. And, uh, mm. and uh, who else? Just Rosa? Yes, Rosa. Uh, Rosa. Ah, okay, okay. Okay. Uh, uh -huh. Okay, go ahead, Wilfredo. I would think. Uh, teacher, with, with Rosa, we were talking about when in, in our company, um, we have some problems. For example, in my case, I told her that um, it is a good strategy to get a meeting with the employees and with a teamwork and give them currently situation about the problem. Uh, for example, I, I told her that, for example, in my company, the quality, efficiency, it is uh, every day we, and every hour we are talking about quality, about our efficiency. Then when we have a big problem, we have to make a, an a good strategy every week. But I told to Rosa that it is depend uh, about the frequency that we have some problem. Then in my case, I, I told her that this, this strategy to get, to get the mirroring with uh, with with and with uh, our teamwork, it, I I in my uh, 20, 24 years that I was working in my company, it is the best strategy that we can do it. 
All right, all right, very good, very good. Excellent, um, thanks. And Rosa uh, is going to continue with that. Are you sleeping? strategy no <laughs> <laughs> yes i i it, it was the same at the at the warehouse when the when the general manager comes to scala 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 after that uh, my boss uh, have a meeting with us and tell us uh, what happened, what things we can do better, what things we can do anymore. We, mm -hmm. we, need, we need to change. We need to change the process, <laughs> the things that we are doing, because the general manager says, I don't like it, do that. Okay, we, have, we need to, to change many things. And every week we have a meeting and we talk about the situations. If, if uh, the, the situation is, is going on in a good way, uh, okay, continue. If, if the situation is um, difficult or is um, uncomfortable, we need no, I like, I like to do this. And in that way, we change the, the methods to do the things. I think that in that way, uh, the employees uh, are engaged with the with the company to do the to do the, the things in a better okay perfect okay, okay. sweet thanks you can stop sharing <laughs> sorry all right guys we don't have enough time to continue sharing. Uh, just a quick reminder. Uh, remember, the platform has to be updated today or tomorrow the latest because tomorrow is the last day. So I need you guys to work on that. For the ones that have not worked at all, you may have problems if you don't do it. Okay, You may have problems if you don't do it. Remember that the platform is a requirement uh, for if you want to continue with the next module, yes, okay, it's it's uh, I'm I'm being I'm serious with this, okay, it's a it's a one of the main one of the main requirements to continue in the next level, okay. If you don't work on the platform, you won't be able to continue uh, in the next level. And also, I think uh, a person from administration shared some information with you through the chat about about the paperwork or about your documents so guys ask okay ask your your manager ask the human resources about these these documents and how how the process is going mm -hmm. and uh you were also reporting that there was a problem with the exercise it has already been fixed if you go to the platform you will find out that the exercise has already been fixed and also the, the, the survey is for tomorrow. Okay, we're going to do the, the survey tomorrow all together over here during class. I do not know the exact time, so I need everybody to be on time. I need you guys to be early. You listen, do you hear that, Rosa? I need you guys to be very, very early tomorrow, okay? <laughs> so please, people, be early, okay? Hey, Maurice. Yes. Do you know if the admin will be available on Saturday? Because we I don't, don't have I don't think the, so. The, the payroll. I don't think so. I'm not really okay. sure about that. I'm not really sure about. I don't think it, they are available on Saturday. If they are, then uh, they might be available only in the morning, not in the afternoon. But I'm going to ask. Okay. I'm going to ask. Okay. Because we don't have the payroll available until the thirtieth. So okay. and I I know that I'm pretty sure that they will go. Uh, on vacation on Monday, right? Yeah, they will. They will. They will go on vacation on three days, I think. I'm not sure. Yes. Okay. And remember, Luis, you have to you have to request the exam. Remember, you have to re request the exam. Yes, I, I, I did it. Thank you. Okay. Perfect. And they will uh, give you the dates to do the exam. Okay. Yes. All right. 
let me take attendance and then we are going to free to go sleep people and tomorrow we finish so be happy okay Ooh. no yeah <laughs> okay tomorrow we're going to celebrate we're going to celebrate with with uh with this the friday with this It's a joke, okay, don't celebrate. Okay, let me take attendance real quick and then we will go. Okay, Ana Patricia, hello. Present, present. My computer is frozen, I'm sorry. People, today is not your day, huh? The, my computer is not working. Oh, no. okay. Teacher, today is not your day. <laughs> no, I'm okay. I'm okay. I, I go. I go to bed at one a.m. every day, so no problem. For me, I can. I can continue being here with you guys. <laughs> okay. Yes. All right. Let me take attendance. Ana Patricia. Present. Adriana Stephanie. Present. Ana Selmi was not here today. Gabriel Alejandra? Present. Gloria Elizabeth? Here. Guadalupe El Carmen? Jose Ernesto? Present, teacher. Julia Patricia? Present. Carla Verónica? Present, teacher. Lourdes Beatriz? Hello, Lourdes. Lourdes is having. Uh, microphone problems. Luis Orlando? Teacher. What happened? <laughs> I'm here. Yes, yes. Your microphone is not working well, huh? Or your Thank internet. You. I don't know. Yes. Nelson Edgardo? Present teacher. Ophelia Orellana? Yes, teacher. Mm, Pamela Beatriz? Mm -hmm. Present teacher. Okay, uh, Sandra Gladi. Present teacher. Susana Carolina. Present. Walter Mauricio. Present. Wilfredo Guardado. Present teacher. Good evening. Zulma Rosaura. Good evening. <laughs> Good evening, good night. Good night, good night, ah, okay. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Flor de, Flor de Maria. Present, good night. Edwin and Wendy were not here. Okay, people, thank you for being here. I will see you guys tomorrow, okay? Be ready for tomorrow. Okay, guys, see you, take care, have a good night. And a sleep. Good night. Okay. Yes. Good night, good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow early. <laughs> <laughs> Good night. Bye. 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 Bye, guys. Sweet dreams. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. You too. Thanks.